Hey guys, it's your girl Tama Wren with EverythingGirlsLove.com and I'm here to show you how I slay my eyebrows. First, I'll start off by putting a little bit of primer on my eyebrows. This just helps keep my hairs in place because they can be a bit unruly. Then I'll go in with my Maybelline Brow Drama Gel and just kind of brush upwards um, so you can really see each hair and this just helps keep them in place before you add the dip brow. Next I'm going to go in with my Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow in Dark Brown. I also have the brush that comes with the Dip Brow. Um, this is a two-sided brush, so one side is an angled liner brush, which really helps get that sharp, defined point that you want for your brows. And the other side is more of like a spoolie brush. I really like to take my time with this process and I always put my mirror on the very, very magnified side so I can see everywhere that I'm missing um, and where I need to add more product. For the end of my brow, I kind of go in the same horizontal direction of my brow, but once I get to the very top of my brow, I'll start going in upward strokes so that way it will define the hair and make it look more natural. I really like my brows to look more natural instead of very drawn on. So doing that upward stroke really just helps define each hair and it just makes it look super natural instead of just caked on with product. After this step, I'll go in with my BH Cosmetics Studio HD Brow Pencil and I'll just kind of fill in anywhere where I missed. The Anastasia product can be a little bit heavy, so this brow pencil kind of just lightly fills in all the areas that may have gaps. It's okay if you're not super perfect when you go in with the Anastasia Dip Brow because you can just clean it up later with concealer, which I'm going to do in the next step. Yes, honey, these brows are starting to come to life. Now just go ahead and brush out your brows and remove any excess that you have before you add the concealer. Now I'm going to go with my Tarte Under Eye Perfector with a flat concealer brush and just clean up any mistakes that I've made and really help define my brow bone. I prefer to use a concealer that's not too far off from my skin tone just so it's not crazy noticeable that you have a bunch of concealer under your eyebrows and on the top of your eyebrows. Once I add the concealer, I just lightly pat it in and blend it in with my finger. Just to clean up the tip a little bit, um, just go in. I don't go in over my whole eyebrow with concealer. I just get the ends of it to really define my point at the end of the eyebrow. So this is pretty much my go-to routine to make my eyebrows pop. Make sure to tag us at Everything Girls Love or at Taya.Marin on Instagram. I would definitely love to see you guys' eyebrow tutorials. Thanks for watching.